Hello, Brian Myers with Winning Solutions Inc. and I've got another Microsoft Access Expert tutorial for you. Today we're going to look at one of our database templates available from our website at microsoftaccessexpert.com and we're going to look at a contact database. This is a database that you can download and build upon or you can contact us and we can enhance it for you. We're going to look here on the left side of our website under the database templates and we're going to grab the contact database. There's a brief introduction here, some screenshots of the product. Uh, there's a place to download the demo, which I'll show you here in a moment. And we've also got a place where you can purchase two different versions of the product. Uh, so after the video, head back here and get yourself a full version of the product. I'm going to start by right-clicking on the download button here and say save link as. And I like to save my stuff to the desktop, so make sure we're on the desktop there. The file has been downloaded, so we can go ahead and close out our browser. And this is a downloaded zip file. Uh, if you need to know more information on how to deal with zip files, I'll put a link to a video below. It'll tell you all the information you need to know about zip files. I'm just going to start by right-clicking and say Extract All. I'm going to extract these to the desktop, and I'm going to show the uh, extracted files once it's done. So here we go. We've got our database our contact, uh, customer contact demo database. Uh, keep in mind this is a demo, so anything, any changes you make to the database will not be saved when you close the database. Every time you open it, it's going to be the way it was when you download it, so make sure you get that full version. So I'm going to double click on this, and we're going to get a Microsoft Access Security warning. I'll put a link to how to address this in, in the description below. Uh, it's not harmful. It's just not been added to the Microsoft Trusted Location Center. So I'm going to go ahead and click Open for now. And we've got a couple of options here. We have the ability to maintain lists, to search contacts, and to add new contacts. I'm going to start by doing a search. And we've got all these fields that we can search by. I'm going to start. Let's search by company winning solutions so we've got our results here and there's only one person currently in our database that has the uh, winning solutions set as their company so let's uh, do another search here I'm gonna clear that out and I'm gonna search for actually let's leave it empty and we'll search and we'll see all the records since we didn't put any criteria in there we get all the records back I'm gonna try to search by first name and I will look for J and you can see that returns just that one record. We'll go back here again and do a search for all and show you another feature here where we can export our results directly to Excel. We just click this button here, it fires up Excel, and then you've got the exported data so you can use this in other reports uh, and in other applications if you need or another database. So I'm gonna go ahead and close that out we're, we're kind of done looking at the search functionality, so I'm going to close out that form. And now I'm going to try and add a new contact here. Uh, I'll add myself here as Mr. I'm being all formal. Brian Joseph Myers and company. I work for Winning Solutions, Inc. Job title is Project Manager. We've got an email address. I'll put in my Winning Solutions, Inc. email address. Feel free to contact me at this email and we'll put in our website here we'll put in the uh, Microsoft uh, Microsoft Access expert site uh, we'll enter a phone number here we'll put in our my business phone number which is two three oh. 239-990. Guess we need the area code in there, 515-239-9900. Feel free to call us for access needs at that phone number. Uh, we'll come down here and we'll put in an address, 301 Alexander. Uh, we're at Sweet C. And we're in Ames, Iowa. 50010. You can also add a picture here. I'm not going to do that today. I'm just going to put in a note here. Uh, example entry and click. We can also actually print this record as well. Let's go ahead and check that out. And there's a nice uh, 
uh, printable form with all of my information there. And we'll click Save and Close. And now let's go do some searches and see if I come up here. Uh, we'll do a search for B. And there I am in the, in the records there. Let's try last name of M. And there we go. We've got me up there again. Let's do a double search here. And we'll do B is the first name that we're looking for and winning solutions. We'll do a search. Both Becky and uh, myself come up there because we're both under winning solutions. And that kind of gets us a good view of the search form there. Now let's go look at this maintain list. Now what we're able to do here is we can actually add different uh, address types. If we wanted to enter a different one in there, we can add different companies that will go into the drop down menu. We can also add different types of phone numbers, which we've got a bunch there already in there for you. We can maintain the suffix and we can also maintain the titles. And we can just click on any one of these and let's say we wanted to add a new company here. We just come in and Acme Company. And now when we go back there, there it is. We can go ahead and close out. Let's see that that is in there. And see now it lists the Acme Company. So you can actually maintain some of the fields that are within the search form and the uh, add new contact form. Uh, don't forget to give us a like and subscribe to our channel. We add videos fairly re frequently. Uh, also, you can hit us up on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, and LinkedIn. I will put links to those in the description below. As always, if you have any access needs, feel free to contact us. Contact information is in the description below as well. And have a great day. Thanks.